Greetings, YouTube! I got a UU battle. Haven't really done one of those in a while. Against Prankstar73, because he basically contacted me and requested a UU battle. So, yeah. I'm leading off with my Cafagrius. This is a Trick Room team. So, um, I try to get that Trick Room up, and I do. Fabulous gets paralyzed on the next turn, which kind of sucks. He U turns out into Porygon Z. I go for the Hidden Power Fighting, takes down most of his health. He switches out into Whimsicott. Yeah, I don't know why Porygon doesn't disappear. It's probably like a glitch with the log or something. Whatever. Anyways, I kill it with Shadow Ball, which is fucking cool. So, Cafagrius has a little sweep going on. Or at least he will, because Miss Magius will die to this Shadow Ball. Yeah, now he's got a little sweep going on. And, uh, yeah, so that's pretty cool. He switches into Cobalion. He goes for Calm Mind to boost his special defense and special attack. I go for Hidden Power Fighting. No, Trick Room first. I go for Trick Room. Get my health sapped by Leech Seed. He goes for Calm Mind again. I go for the Hidden Power Fighting, or try to, but I get fucking paralyzed because Ooxie just had to be a little douche and use Thunder Wave. Ah, well, whatever. So, Hidden Power Fighting takes down a large chunk of his health. And, um... Yeah. So now Cafagrius is sitting here pretty. I go for Nasty Plot just to keep up with, uh... Cobalion's boosts. Because it's boosting quite a bit. It's got quite a lot of, um... Special Defense and Special Attack boosts. I go for the Hidden Power Fighting, that takes down a large chunk of his health. He goes for Calm Mind again. He's sitting here at plus five, special attack and special defense. So that really sucks. Trick Room ends, so I have to try and set it up again. Now he is plus six. I go for Hidden Power Fighting. Doesn't do that much. Well, it does a little bit, but not enough to kill him. He goes for the Flash Cannon, I die. So, yeah, Cafagrius' sweep has pretty much ended. I send in Porygon 2 to try and set up the Trick Room because um, Porygon 2 is probably the bulkiest Pokemon on my team. He goes for Flash Cannon. I don't know why he went for Flash Cannon as opposed to Focus Blast or some type of fighting type move. But yeah, I set up that Trick Room. I try to go for T-Bolt. Does a piss amount of damage. And... Flash Cannon takes me out. So yeah, now I switch out into Dawn Fan. Trick Room's up, so I go first. And I go for the Earthquake. That takes care of Cobalion. Switches out into Uxi. He's named Andros. And I'm thinking, like, dude, I love that game. Star Fox 64 is the shiznit. He goes for Heal Bell. I'm not sure what he was going for Heal Bell for, but um, I go for Stone Edge. It misses! I know I say this a lot, but that really sucks big donkey balls. It really, really does. I hate it when attacks miss. Like, all these super inaccurate attacks, like Stone Edge, Hydro Pump, uh, stuff like that. I go for the Trick Room. So I go first next turn. I go for Close Combat. Super effective. And yeah, that's pretty cool. He sends out his Andross. And I go into my Gatorade. Which is my Feraligator. He goes for U-turn. He has no Pokemon left. So he stays in. It's just damage at this point. I get paralyzed. I go for the Swords Dance. And I go for Waterfall. Does not do that much. He goes for U-Turn. Trick Room ends. And, yeah. U-Turn. And I go for the Waterfall to take him out. And that is the end of the game. So, good job, Prankstar73. Well fought, well played, all that fun stuff. See you all next time, guys.